Now two bowlers, please come in and get paid. Please come in and get paid now. Joe Sienna to the German office, please. Joe Sienna. Everybody, welcome back to Yankee Lanes for the singles event. This is Eliminator style finals. We're in round three. This is Chris Forey. I'm with Amanda Broge, Anthony Najokis. We have eight bowlers left. Elimination finals. Lanes are uh, pretty tricky so far. 214 round one, 215 round two to get through. I know it sounds pretty high, but still the pair to pair. And uh, Hardy drew the same pair. Yeah. Must luck be nice. Luck of the draw. I don't know if that's good or bad sometimes. Well, he shot 215, so. Okay. Right. Uh, was he the I think he was 215. He was 215. So, uh, okay. yeah. A uh, couple courses here that we really like. Uh, we have uh, John Wilbur look really good on the last pair. Uh, so did Andrew Hall. I mean, obviously, these guys, anybody that got through look good. Alex. 
Alex switch balls. Yep, so just so everybody understands why uh, Steve and Hardy ended up on the same pair. It's luck of the draw. We put uh, currently eight chips were put out and uh, luck of the draw. So <gasps> Colby on lane 11 with a fallback. Uh, yeah, Colby, uh, Colby is good at that, the fireball. <laughs> he doesn't throw as hard as he used to. Uh, he used to what, what was that tournament that they used to bowl a long Delta. time ago? Uh, I'm trying to think of it. It was like a team tournament. It was him by Ali. Can't think of it. Oh, Bill Webb. Webb drew the uh, same pair, right? He did draw the same pair, yeah. John Wilbur. Same ball. John, John Wilbur up and at him. He got a great look. Awesome. Dennis Real is watching. I really share the fo share there, Dennis. Share the feed, but uh, yeah, but again, I once again, uh, we are on. If you are watching, uh, again, we apologize if there's any technical difficulties uh, with the stream. Uh, the Wi-Fi isn't great. I do see a little yellow sign just popped up. Wi-Fi isn't great. Neither is the uh, unfortunately the Wi-Fi is good. Unfortunately, it just doesn't stream great for us, and the LTE service is not the best. So, but please share. Uh, we are down to eight bowlers. Uh, Wilbur, like I said, Wilbur's looking really good here. He has a really good look. Whoa, Webb. That was up and in, but it still stayed. Yeah, uh, Webb missed in a little bit. But and Nick uh, Marion's been looking good, but I mean, obviously, everybody that's left is looking pretty good. Yeah. But <laughs> He's going to sneak it into the There's top John eight. Wilbur, though. Yo, no Ooh. nickels. So, uh, <coughs> we had a good turnout. I think uh, is Frankie Kalka the last, the lone lefty here? He is. He is. Kalka. Here we go. Kalka, very nice. We had 128 bowlers, uh, 32 finalists. Now, 128 doesn't seem like a lot for Aniba, but we only had two squads of qualifying, uh, just the morning and afternoon squad, 57 this morning. It's only a 24-lane center, so we go to up to six on a pair, something a little different. Uh-oh. Oh, Wilbur misses Bear on lane 11. Nick Marion, very nice on lane 17. So we went to six on a pair this morning, a little light, 57 entries. Uh, some guys, I think, uh, slept in. Uh, this afternoon we were 71 entries, so one short of selling out. Uh, great turnout. Uh, leader was uh, for the whole weekend was Chris Viley, for, I should say for today, Chris Viley. 975 this morning, and the cut score was 865. And Oof. then uh, this afternoon, Russ Michaud, super senior, 951. Low was, uh, to make the cut, 862 was Corey Nichols. And then our at-large cut, 849. So again, you can see the scoring pace. We only bowled four games uh, because of the six on a pair. But 849, uh, only a little over 210 average, you know, 212 plus. So. Did Andrew Hall draw the same lane, 17 and 18? I think Andrew was on 19 and 20. Oh, okay. He was on uh, 19 and 20 with Cavignero. He just 3, 6, 9, 10 right, twice in a row. He's having some difficulty on lane 17 and 18. That's why I was that. wondering if he drew the same lanes. Alex is looking solid. Alex is looking good on lanes 15 and 16. What ball is uh, Andrew throwing, do you think? Andrew's throwing a hypercell skid. Yeah, he loves those <coughs> things. I drilled a bunch of those He has like four. I think that's his pinup one. But it's looks like it's. I mean, we have a bad angle here to see what his ball is doing, but looks like it's just breeding early and hooking a lot. I don't know that that doesn't happen here. No. Ah. <coughs> but uh, we do want to thank Jeff Barden and his staff. Uh, Jeff, uh, I've talked to him a bunch this weekend. Uh, he's been a great host. Probably one of the. We have a lot of great hosts, but I mean, just uh, he's been here all weekend with us. He was in the booth last night. Um, I just uh, not, don't have a lot of great things to say about the guy. I mean, uh, I've, first time I ever met him, but fabulous town to come to, too. I mean, the town of Keene is it, beautiful. It has a lot of really Character. Great, yeah, it does. It, it has a lot of really great shops. I know we went downtown last year when we were here. Yep. There were some great restaurants, a little chocolate shop. It was phenomenal. Yeah, my uh, Janine and uh, Christian, J Christian's out sleeping, but uh, they, they went to the uh, kids' museum, and uh, she raved about it. She, I just went out to the car to say hello because he's sleeping, and... Uh, she uh, uh, she was raving about how the children's place was. It was 
very inexpensive to get in. I feel like John Wilbur's catching it a little bit at the bottom too much. Grab that one a little bit. Yeah. Nice golf course too. Uh, uh, did you play? Yeah, I played in the outing Friday. Well, Frank Calco with Well, I attempted to play in the outing Thanks Friday. Thanks for the invite. What do you mean? You see how these kids are? Uh, you know what? Anthony never invites me to anything. Right. He only calls me when he needs my blow-up mattress. That is so true. That is totally that is true. true. I when you start saying blow-up, I thought no, we were getting no, into something. No, 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 no. <laughs> he calls me up on Thursday. He's like, yo, you guys got that blow-up mattress? <laughs> that is I true. I clean out my whole basement. <laughs> To find this kid is blow up match. You never answered me. I said yes. You never I'm sorry. Said yes. I'm banging on my microphone. And then so um, he doesn't come get the blow up mattress, <laughs> and he comes up here. I'm like, well, I'm not bringing the blow up. I mattress. do only call Amanda for the hair mattress. That is true. Or if Self, I'm, I call RJ. Or if I'm cooking dinner. I'll call RJ. No, he group texts us. Or if I'm cooking dinner and his parents aren't. Are you still doing the uh, that is true. the food thing that gets sent to you? We do. We do still do HelloFresh. I got to tell you, my husband lost a lot of weight. So if anybody on HelloFresh is listening. That's right. HelloFresh. <laughs> we are looking for sponsors. We, we are, are doing great. We are looking for sponsors. We, we actually have, yes. we have like uh, 12 sponsors. I mean, we keep growing. So HelloFresh, Ms. Am Amanda Broge is using your product. We really are. And, and you know what? I got to say. And, and, and RJ, I will <laughs> say, he did slim down. Right. He has and lost he, a lot of weight. He lost a lot of weight. He looks good. And he's he's looking good. Is uh, I can see his form. His form. <laughs> <laughs> Better balance. No, no, but I, I got to say, too. Like no, he does. He looks so good. It's so easy. And it, I, you know what? I made it for lunch yesterday. It's phenomenal. I, I love it. It's great. I yeah. think things like that, you know, like, and, and I'm not trying to, obviously, we're joking. I mean, having fun about t getting, talking about a sponsor. But when you talk about Hello Fresh or something like that, I know they advertise a little bit, but yeah, it's, but it's about word of mouth. It really is. Oh, and that I one must be hooking because uh, Colby's just checked up. Sorry about that. This is unrelated from bowling, but as a teacher, i got to tell you that I've gotten at least seven teachers in my school to do HelloFresh, and I've gotten a couple of my friends to do HelloFresh because it's so easy. People love it. And you know what? Price-wise, how is it? It's like, it's like 800 calories, so you're going to lose weight no matter what. It's tremendous. We look right. like we're, we're having some trouble on lanes getting, 11 and 12. Getting a little loud behind us. I'm not sure what's quite going it's on. It's pretty rowdy. Yeah, it seems a little loud behind us, right? Mm. Yeah, it's not a, I don't know. But 11 and 12 is where I started, and it looks like someone lit a match with that pair. Um, it's on yeah. fire. I moved like eight boards in the game. And uh, again, uh, just a reminder from our producer, uh, Tim, because unfortunately we don't see what's going on with the stream. Uh, Mentioning uh, LTE and the Wi-Fi, a uh, little bit of a struggle here. Uh, good signal of Wi-Fi in the building. For some reason, I think it's everybody's pinging it. It just uh, we don't get great connection. And then with the LTE service, uh, not not very good around. We have about two bars, so um, we'll see how it goes. Uh, obviously, we're streaming, and at the same time, we save it. Uh, we save it to the to the card, and we'll push it live. Or excuse me, we'll push out the recording uh, this week. This looks like it's a big score discrepancy. There's four high scores, and then there's. I mean, look at Alex scores. on lane 15. I'm sorry. He has front five. And uh, just real quick, we need to uh, also, if you are watching, please uh, share the finals, get more viewers. Uh, but we are. Uh, we know it's a beautiful weekend here outside, front, front and the stream six, isn't. Guys. And the stream isn't great, but uh, oh, that Alex Cavagnaro guy. Listen, if, if I love Alex's game. I've, I've liked it ever since he was like 12 years he's old. Un, I mean, I got to tell you, he is I've unbelievable. Known him for a while. If he throws a dot, got injured. I don't want to bowl him when he's not injured. Well, that's oh, the thing. I don't want to bowl him when he's injured either. He Wilbur. is injured, and he's throwing it phenomenal. Wilbur with an interesting play there. I don't think he moved his feet. It looked like Change he moved balls. his eyes. Nah, he's yeah. doing Change harder, balls. too. He moved his eyes for the left. His ball was more toward, more up the middle of the lane, so it pushed back instead of. I still think he's same throwing. Same ball? Uh, yeah, he's still it's throwing same Maver ball? Maverick Pearl. Oh, I thought it was. Green going down the lane. Uh, Maverick Pearl. Same ball, but he played track. it more in front of him, so the ball, so the ball drifted back. No, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. Once again, we do know that the stream is a little choppy. Uh, we apologize. Nothing we can do about that. We are at the mercy of the LTE service, but we will keep on going, and we will have this up on uh, Facebook tomorrow. Sorry, guys. We still love you. We're trying, uh, but. This is the bad thing about technology. We can't control that part of it. Just what we do. Are you sure that Wilbur didn't make a ball change? No ball change. Uh, it looked green going down lane 12. Bill Webb switched balls and left a 10 Yes, pin. he did. Looks like he's in a... Nick Mariner. Marion. Marion. Sorry, That's I'm close. sorry. That's okay. Don't kill me. Oh, well. Oof. Oh. All right. 
But still, you got a good game going there. It's a big, good shot there. Uh, reminder there about the uh, Hall of Fame dinner coming up. We're going to keep pumping that until we're through, but uh, Hall of Fame dinner, last chance to purchase tickets is August 16th for the dinner. Uh, come out and support your your Hall of Fame inductee friends. We have 54 inductees, 49 for bowling, and five for meritorious service. So thank you, everyone. And congratulations to, to all that made it. What's being served at that dinner, Chris? It's buffet. Oh. We did buffet style because, uh, you know, I th I've been to a few weddings. Good. I actually like that a little bit better. Really? It is because I don't have to choose a one thing I want to eat. I see. You can look at it and decide in the moment. Yeah, you get to decide and you can pick a little bit of everything. So it's it's nice. Uh, so Will we're there be sushi? Um, no. <laughs> but I bet you there's roast beef. Roast beef. <laughs> Man, are you hungry? I might be a little bit hungry. It's like Hello Fresh and Sushi. Hey, we got I from Hello Fresh to Sushi. So Sorry, if we have Co we have a Kobe Steakhouse uh, nearby <laughs> that wants to sponsor an Eva. That, there's uh. a really great taco place. Andrew. Uh, All right, Andrew. Ball what? keeps going high. He's left at 3 6 10 like six times this game. He keeps, he keeps moving Calca, left, though, too. looking really good here. Oh, and as I say that, Thanks, he Chris. three Chris. pins. I'm that the, ball, no what's shot. What's happening here? I'm the, I'm the curse. That Chris, ball, no stop. shot. Uh, once again, broadcast has been interrupted. Right. We apologize. <laughs> wow, we're going with magic. We're going with the super high scores from Gillick here. He says uh, Nick Marion, 280. 280 max from Nick Marion. Alex Cavernero, <coughs> 300. Stephen Harder, Stephen Harder, 247. And John Wilbur, 246. And then the other four scores may not even break 200. So 240 might be the. So I'm, I'm going to say, I'm going to lower expectations a little bit to the 220s, Tim. I think 225 is going to be a number. I think that's, that works. I would love to see Alex Wilbur. I know we're six frames in, but. Yeah, halfway home. It'd be and pretty. Yeah. It'd be if it gets to two forty something, that'd, that'd be, be amazing. What well, I feel like kind <laughs> of like could. they're all playing the fallback. At some point though, seven ten. Yeah. Flat seven, flat ten. But um, give a little shout out also to uh, Logo Infusion. Logo Infusion uh, supplies us with our champions jerseys, so please uh, support them. All Neva bowlers and friends and families, please support Logo Infusion. Visit their website, LoganFusion.com. They make great apparel. Uh, I just actually ordered uh, some shirts. I was just going to ask you, how are their shirts? I'm, I'm in the market for new shirts. And if you, oh, they're great. Uh, if you use the code BOLNEBA, use the code BOLNEBA, and you will save 20% off on your shirt. So once again, uh, use the code BOLNEBA, save an additional 20%. I need like an extra small. Is Frankie Kalka, I thought that might go broken. It just stayed right on the hip end. All right. Spare um, it up, Frankie. So... Thank you again, folks at Logo Fusion, Ken Keegan. Uh, Cambridge Credit Counseling, uh, that would be Chris Viley, who just unfortunately lost. Cambridge Credit Counseling is your destination for debt relief services. Visit cambridgecredit.org to learn more about how they can help you with your credit card debt, student loan repayment options, and mortgage relief services. Chris is my friend. I should ask him about how to help pay off my student debt. Uh, in uh, other news, write a check. Uh, Alex just trips four on lane 15 for eight in a row. I know that's Cr news. A Chris by Alley, if you're listening, I have a few student loans. Yeah. Um, also, uh, Better Bowling Concepts. Better Bowling Concepts is owned by NEBA members conveniently located inside Norwich Bowling and Entertainment Center. They specialize in customer service, providing their customers with the best ball motion possible, as John Kirker and Bill Daly and Pete Marion. Uh, his son, uh, Pete's son, Nick, is, is the one bowling right now. He had a big game going. I can't quite see down there. Way to punch his hand really hard, Amanda. Yeah, Amanda, that wasn't good. I love you just him. punched his broken hand. I did not punch his broken hand. That was his left hand. No, it wasn't. It was his right hand. Oh, it was, was his right it? Hand. Oh, yes. God. It I mean, doesn't matter. That's not where it hurts, and we're going to lunch tomorrow I'm anyway. I'm going to say, I hate to tell Colby this. And talk about food again. 218 uh, might be I out of wood. I love food. Why, why you guys got to hate on food? I mean, I'm sorry. Uh, also, I want to give a shout-out because we had a golf event this weekend uh, here. And, Who won? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if they actually played for anything other was, than fun. No, why would you just? Why no, no. would you? Why would you just play for fun? You got a, All right, calm down. You got to win. You, you, got, you got money into the pro shop. Oh, Bill Go Webb with the ball change. The that ball was that a snap block a there? Double. No, that's a daredevil. I don't think that was a snap block. It was okay. a daredevil. Yep, yep. I, Ooh, right. lane nine. But, uh, so uh, we want to thank Ace Mitchell, though, who uh, and Vinny Grazon and Jeff Mraz for their support of Neva. I love Ace Mitchell. Sorry. Is there anything you don't love? Let's not get started. I, I was but like, he, there's a laundry <laughs> list, but I do love Ace Mitchell. But Ace Mitchell Bowlers Mart is the world's largest bowling <laughs> distributor. 
So Vinny thank you very much, amazing. guys. Vinny's great. Vinny was here yesterday. Uh, he's been I away from him. He's been away from home for about a, a week or two, he yeah, said. They just, they just had the trade Hold. show up in Turning Stone. Yep, now Alex, he's front nine. Front nine for Alex Cavagnero. He looks so nervous. Uh, uh, that's a joke. <laughs> Anthony is joking. We are trying to switch the feed. Sorry, Frank. So that you can see. Oof. Lanes 15 and 16 with Alex Caminero up in the 10th. He has front nine, working on 300. Thank you, Amanda, for covering for me for a second. Oh, you're welcome. Let's see. Frankie Calco with the bad break. Uh, yep, he realizes he's out of wood, so he just... Uh, Alex, lane 15. All right. Front, front 10. All right. Also want to give a shout out to our great friends at Brunswick. Uh, my friend Brian Graham, Bailey Orlikowski, Parker Bone, Jordan Vanover. Thank you very much for all you do for us here at NEBA, sponsoring the Tournament of Champions, uh, donating balls per tournament. Uh, fortunately, I'm not really sure who won the ball. Uh, I can tell you who won the table. <laughs> that would be you. Uh, Jimmy Pritz won one ball, but we usually do a drawing for the other one, so I'm oh. not sure who won the drawing ball. But Jimmy Pritz was the uh, high man out of the finals, uh, so he did win the ball. But thank in. you for he what they do in. for us. Ugh, Alex, uh, he missed I don't know if that ball slam by Kalka got him in his backswing or not, but, I mean, he's not really concerned about it. He made it through. Right, but, he's fine. Uh, we're going to rotate it back to try and get these matches in front of us because uh, we have uh, down at the end... We do have a 280 by Nick Marion. Yes. Uh, Andrew Hall with 178. Uh, we're going to try and move the camera around to catch you because Webb is getting up next. So we got, uh, let's do a quick little rundown. So we got 236, a 280. That's two guys in. We have, uh, I, I think Hardy needs to get to 227. With his 246. Uh, so we have 289. So one, two, so 289, 280, 246. So the next guy, we got Webb, go up. Webb can go out for 232. Or Stephen Hardy Jr. can go out for 227. So it's Webb needs a double. Gillick, am I right? Webb needs a double? All right, we got a nod there. Well, either Webb needs a double or Hardy doesn't strike here. But Webb needs this one for sure. That looks good. Going out. Oh, oh, swishing four. So that gets him to two, uh, 211. Hardy will advance. The number will be whatever Hardy posts. <laughs> Alex has a really great look, but I also think that Wilbur has a really great look if he doesn't bowl on 11 and 12. Yeah. Just, I mean, 11 and 12. Congratulations like to uh, Stephen player. Hardy Jr. He last man into the finals at 220. He can go a strike here for 227. So we ha we know our final four. We have John Wilbur, Alex Cavagnero, Nick Marion. Nick Marion was in the final match yesterday in the doubles. Who did he bowl with? He bowled with John Kirker. Oh. Uh, and then we have... I feel like I just missed somebody as we were talking and Steve Hardy Jr. We're just waiting to see what he finishes with. Right, Steve Hardy. Yep, he's uh, in. John Wilbur. Yep. Alex Cabanero. And Nick Marion. And Nick Marion. That's, yep. that's the four. Nice bowling there by Stephen Hardy. Very nice. All right, folks. We, we can tell you what the number is. We don't need the announcement. The number 27. is 227. We're going to sign off. We'll be back for the final four. See you in a few minutes.